Okay, today I'll be making a smoothie using the magic bullet. All the ingredients I'll be using, I'll name them all in this video, and also I will be eyeballing all the ingredients I'll be using, so not exact measurements. So let's get started. First of all, you need milk. I use 2% milk, or I drink it. Some sugar. You can use yogurt instead of sugar if you want to, but I'll be using both. And I use Activia, of course. Frozen fruit, strawberries, and blueberries. You don't need to have fr frozen fruit, you can just have fresh fruit. Then also, I have a banana. Then, crucial for the video, you'll be needing the ma magic bullet, the thing to blend all your ingredients, a cup, or whatever it's called, to put in the magic bullet and that uh, it holds all your ingredients so you can make your smoothie or whatever. Also, optional, you can use condensed milk. I have it in the container here. I'll show you the condensed milk I'll be using. Here's the condensed milk I'm be using. It's Long Eviti brand. Sweetened condensed milk. This is what it is. It's really creamy. Well, not creamy, but really sweet. I like the taste personally. Some people find it too sweet and stuff, so yeah. First of all, I like putting my sugar in. So I think I'll be taking one scoop. I'll be taking one scoop since I have my yogurt. Second step, I'll be taking my yogurt in. And also, I put condensed milk in too. Here's my condensed milk. Pop right open and then Here's the creamy stuff. And it's really thick. Look, it's really thick and stuff. See, this is what I'll be putting in my smoothie. Whoa, shoot. You can see, there's still condensed milk on this thing. Or can you see it? Here you go, I think. Better view or image of it. Next, my yogurt. Since put it in. Whoa! Take my yogurt. Whoa. If you're making your own smoothie, you don't have to use banana, strawberries, and blueberries. Also, for yogurt, I'd be, I'm using blueberry. You don't have to use blueberry yogurt. You can use plain, any flavor you want. So now, I'll be putting in my banana. Now, since my banana is too long, I'm going to stick it in. Well... And since I have to hold on to the camera as well, it's hard for me to record. See, my beautiful bananas. Next, I'll be putting in the blueberries. Push it down all the way. Then the strawberries how much fruit you put in it will make the color of your smoothie I'm gonna put in about two strawberries afterward I'm going now I'm gonna take the milk opening it going to pour it in see I just eyeballed it I have no idea how much I put in optional but if you want to put in crushed ice you can this makes the thickness of the smoothie see 
I'm not putting in all this. So. This. Oh, yeah, I am. Ha ha ha. Whoa, ha ha ha. Now we'll be putting on the cap. It's a twist on cap, so. Now that the cap has been put on, I want you to shake your smoothie, like so. Put it in the blender. Uh, oops, okay, wait a sec. No, it's kind of fizzing. I mean, if you have a magic bullet, I suggest you blend it for about 10 seconds unless everything is not blended completely. Now I'll be opening the cap and then showing you the consistency of the smoothie. Here's the smoothie finished product. Aha! I am new to filming, so of course it's going to be a little shaky while filming my few videos. Then, usually I'll take the cap, put in the sink, and then I rinse it. like clean then put it into the dishwasher of course you need to clean up your mess there it goes now I'll be enjoying my smoothie I've been made thank you for watching and please be watching my other videos I'll be making soon in the future and my old videos oh my god and I don't even pay attention when I video this. So here. And if you want your smoothie to be a little thicker, add more ice. Since mine is on a little runny side. Yeah. Bye.